Hi, I am Har Patel. Hi, I am Adash Basir, and we are from Nirmal University. We have been working on a project named RFID Assisted Traffic and Parking Management System. It is intended for Indian traffic conditions where unnecessary traffic is created by undisciplined parking. Our solution to traffic problem due to undisciplined parking consists of three parts: RFID tag, RFID reader, and Texas Instrument CC3200 Launchpad. RFID tag is attached to the vehicle windshield glass and the rest two parts the reader and the mcu will be mounted on no parking board which will be located on the roadside the tags can be of many type these are uhf ultra high frequency tags which means they operate in the frequency range of 840 to 960 megahertz these are this is a passive rfid tag and this is a windshield RFID tag which means this can be attached to the windshield of a car which will give the car a unique identification number. This is Texas Instrument CC3200 Launchpad. Texas Instrument CC3200 Launchpad contains CC3200 system on chip IC which has ARM Cortex M4 at its core. The, uh, the Launchpad has a, has a built-in Wi-Fi network processor which supports 802.0 one one B G N standards. We have chosen T I C C three two three C C three two double zero launchpad due to its ability to operate both as W line station as well as W line access point. It communicates with RFID reader via UART jumper cables. Third part of our system is the RFID reader. This is the RFID reader, but due to its micro size, we cannot explain it. In the video, we will have to explain it via circuit diagram. This is the circuit diagram of our RFID reader. At the heart of this RFID reader is the AS393 reader IC, which is provided by Austria Microsystem. This RFID IC handles the RFID related protocols like EPC Class 1 Generation 2. This RFID reader IC is then connected to balloons at direct, a transmitter side and receiver side. The work of balloon is to convert balance signal into unbalanced signal. The unbalanced signal is then fed to power amplifier RF2172. The work of this power amplifier is to amplify the signal and give it to directional coupler. The directional coupler is connected to U.FL antenna port and the work of directional coupler is to differentiate between transmitter side signal and receiver side signal. Which work. An RFID reader module has been mounted on roadside. Consider scenario first. Here a car is approaching the RFID module mounted on the roadside. The car is not stopping, it is just passing by. So as you can see on the Texas Instrument CC3200 launch pad, the red LED is flashing indicated, indicating that nothing has happened. And on the web portal you can see that not, no tag has been recorded. This is the second scenario. In the second scenario, a car is stopping near the RFID reader module, but then the car goes away quickly after dropping someone or picking something up. The person has done nothing wrong, and hence on the Texas Instrument CC3200 launch pad, an orange LED will flash indicating that a tag has been detected, a car has been detected, but no data has been uploaded on the web application. Now let's consider the last scenario. Here a car is approaching the no parking zone indicated by the RFID reader module. The car 
will be parked in the no parking zone as indicated in the video. So on the Texas Instrument CC3200 launchpad, a green LED will flash indicating that the data regarding EPC code of the car has been uploaded on the server and the person can be fined appropriately. Thank you for watching.